Welcome to Things You Should Know, The Great War. Today we're going to talk about the Battle of Sur Mountain, fought between Austria-Hungary and the Kingdom of Serbia, located on Sur Mountain in the Kingdom of Serbia on August 15th to the 24th, 1914. Around 11 p.m. on August 15th, 1914, the Serbian 1st Combined Division came across some outposts set up by the Austro-Hungarian army on the slopes of Sur Mountain. Not expecting a full fight, the Austro-Hungarian forces did not leave many troops, and they were driven back quickly. Within an hour, additional Austro-Hungarians had engaged the Serbian troops, and a full fight in the darkness occurred. By the morning of the 16th, the Serbians were victorious and had dislodged the Austrians from the ridge and from the village of Borino Selo. Suffering heavy casualties, the Austrians were panicked in their retreat. The Serbians followed up on the 16th and engaged the 21st Austrian-Hungarian Infantry Division, pushing them completely off the slopes of Sermount. The fighting never fully stopped, and on August 17th, the Serbs attacked the town of Sabak, but elements of the Austrian-Hungarian 2nd Army rebuffed their attempt. Additionally, the Serbian 1st Combined Division attacked the villages of Parlog and Trojan before moving on to Kosin and Grad. The Austrians had more luck repulsing the Serbian 3rd Army, forcing them to move one of their divisions to the town of Valhevo, which was being attacked by the Austrian 42nd Mountain Division. On the morning of the 18th, the Austrians launched another attack, attempting to push the 1st Division off Sabak Bridgehead. The Serbs defeated the Austrians at the Dubrava River, while the Serbian 2nd Army continued its push along Sur Mountain. The fighting continued again into the night, but on the morning of the 19th, the Serbs had finally defeated the Austrians at Kosinengrad. The following day at noon, the Serbs retook several towns and advanced towards Lesnica and Ivrek driving the Austrians back even further. By evening, the Austro-Hungarians were retreating with all coherence destroyed. The Serbs moved in to pursue the Austrians all along the front, and by the 20th, the Austrians were fleeing across the Drina River and back into Bosnia. Upon their triumph at the Sur Mountain, the Serbs sought to recapture their heavily fortified town of Sabak. Violent clashes occurred on the 21st and 22nd of August, during which Serb forces fought their way to the western approaches of the town. By the 23rd, the Serbs had encircled the town and that evening they brought up their siege artillery. On the 24th, the Serbian forces entered Sabak and discovered that the Austro-Hungarians had already left. By 4 p.m., the Serbs reached the banks of the Sava River, bringing the first Austro-Hungarian invasion of Serbia to an end. Both sides suffered heavy casualties. The numbers varied depending on the source, but approximately 35,000 Austrian-Hungarian troops were wounded with another 8,000 killed. Meanwhile, the Serbian casualties were about 15,000 wounded and 3,000 killed. Well, that's it, folks. Join us next time on Things You Should Know, The Great War.